What is good, YouTube? It's your boy Camel K Reacts back with a reaction for you guys today. Back with a bang. This ain't no reaction, this is some game I want to get y'all because I see a lot of y'all being in my comments and tagging me. Because a lot of YouTubers, well, not even YouTubers because they not people who in the game like that, really. They just people who, you know what I'm saying? I ain't saying, I ain't throwing shots and I'm just saying, like, I'm the first YouTuber who actually in the game to do to speak on this, I think, if I'm mistaken. You know what I'm saying? Who actually is in the car game, you feel me? But. A lot of people been saying, Cam, should I get a Hellcat in 2023, make some content? Or should I just get it? They still a good cost to buy. They stop making them. It's a lot of stuff going around, bro. So, I'm going to try to answer a lot of those in this video, bro. But first of all, if you a whole grown man out here, hold up. You a grown man out here and you at, looking at this video to decide if you want a Hellcat, get out. Bro, go on on with that, bro. You too, you too old for that. You make your own money. You make your own decisions, brother. If you want to get you a Hellcat, don't let nobody tell you no. If you want to get you a Scat Pack, get it. If you want to get you a, a V6, get it. You got to be confident in yourself. Don't worry about what no YouTuber say, what I say, what nobody say. You a whole grown man. Hey, man. It's, that's up to you. And if you're a female, don't listen to me neither or nobody else. That ain't your man. You feel me? Respectfully. <laughs> but, yeah, bro. Um, go ask your man and females. But, yeah. um, So, I just type in the market. I ain't been on the market for the league jumps in a good minute. I ain't going to lie to y'all. I haven't looked at the Hellcat market. Like the regular Hellcat, I haven't looked at those. I always looked at Red Eyes and Demons and Superstock now. You feel me? I guess I'm acting totally different, but not for real though. I ain't looked at a regular hair cat in so long, see the prices on them. So I'm glad y'all asked me to do this. But first off the real bro, you do not want off the off the real brother, you do not wanna buy a hair cat with this many miles on it. This junk done been dogged out, went through the city, went probably done got stolen a few times, all type of stuff. You feel me? All type of stuff, Cam. And you do not wanna buy one with this many miles on it. The highest I ever bought a hair cat with miles was twenty thousand. And I paid fifty five thousand for my um Kobe Bryant Hellcat that y'all seen when I first went viral. I paid fifty five thousand. It had twenty thousand miles on it. And this was in twenty eighteen when I was eighteen. I was the first one that um do that title buying a Hellcat at eighteen. I started that. You know, what I mean? <coughs> that buying a Hellcat at eighteen. Your book helped start there. Did I say that? Yeah, I, uh, did I say that? Yeah, I said it. But for real though, I start that way. You feel? I start all. I start a lot of this car stuff, bro. I ain't gonna cap. With these youngsters, I start this whole youngster car wave. I'm telling you. Your favorite YouTuber, watch your boy Kevin McKay and look up to him. Yeah, I'm putting you down. I don't think I ain't. If you, if you type your favorite YouTuber and go ask me, you think I'm capping. I'm putting you down. But what we, let's get out. We're getting out traffic, Cam. We're getting out, we're getting out tra I said traffic. We're getting out topic, Cam. We're getting out topic. I'm thinking about traffic because you're going to be coming up in traffic. You feel me? But um, 82,000, 3,000 miles, I wouldn't buy that. You know what I'm saying? The why, it ain't got no why about it neither. I couldn't do that. Same here. The prices, I guess they decent. I don't know. But like I said, I wouldn't do that. It ain't got the wire body. Now, who is buying these, brother? Who is buying this? For twenty five thousand dollars, you buying a car that look like this? Like, come on, bro. What's the point? I don't understand. Like, cause the bank can't. The bank ain't gonna finance this car, y'all. If y'all don't know it or not, the bank don't finance total cars. So you got to pay twenty five out of pocket. By the time you do that, you can go get you a regular Hellcat or a Red Eye, a Superstar, anything. Put that as your down payment, and your credit gonna be good. And in two years, you're going to get whatever you want. They spend 25 on this total car. You're not going to get your money back on unless you do reference or something. You're probably not on YouTube. So what you going to do with this? Build it back up. If you're YouTube, I can see it. You can build it back up. Like I said, then sell it at the end of the video or ruffle it off. But a regular pedestrian is buying these cars. Why? Why is a regular pedestrian buying these cars? You feel me? Why? I don't understand it. Well, you gonna get you a whole nother car with this same. You really don't need ten thousand dollars for this down payment, and you can get you a Hellcat Red Eye, ten fifteen thousand if you got. You know what I'm saying? I don't know why people do this, and they gotta build the whole car. By the time you build the whole car, you are gonna be out of fifty bands anyway. Go get you a regular Hellcat, brother, and put fifteen thousand down on it, and get you a, a a good reliable car. But first of all, bro, you also you what you want? You do not want to buy a new Hellcat, a new nothing. Don't buy a new car. I'm telling you. If you buy a new car, bro, once you leave out the lot, you lose 10000 automatically. It's no use of buying a new car. You feel me? I buy my car like 5000 8000 miles or below. That's still new to me, brother. 8000 miles still new to me. What we talking? Matter of fact, bro, my grandma and them used to buy cars, bro. You was 70000 80000 miles on them. And they was new to them. Like, I don't know. <laughs> Look at me. Look at my skin. Like. <laughs> hey y'all, yeah, I'm black, so I don't know. I'm black and I'm country. But um, my grandma and them, bro, they got a new car. They just had ninety thousand, hundred thousand miles, one ten. They thought was new. You feel me? And they just rode for three, four, five years back in the day. You know what I'm saying? 
Type in the comment section facts. Them Lexuses, them Toyotas, them Altimas, them Maximas. My grandma and them got that. What else they had? They had on. What, what else? What else my grandma and them had? Yeah, Fruit Cadillacs. Bruh, when they get them drums, bruh, they ride forever. Them the V6s ride forever. And, hey, look, they, they had a new car. You couldn't tell them nothing. So if y'all can get a car, y'all got y'all to have a new car with zero miles or 25 miles or 100 miles. Look, you doing it. Do your thing. You acting totally. Do your thing, bruh. You acting totally different. You feel me? Just know once you leave that car lot, it still ain't new. I'm talking about you can have 20, 25 miles on it. As soon as you drive off the car lot and get you some gas and get your first full tank, you already lost $8,000. You won't, you ain't even got a 1,000 miles. But get when you take to that same dealership, get what the dealership going to say. Uh, the car is now used. It's not new no more. You just drove it to get some gas. You just drove it home. You feel me? You, you could drive it home that same day and go back, to, go back two days later with 300 miles on it. They're going to still say it ain't new and finesse you. That's how car dealerships work. That's why I never buy nothing new no more. Never. Better not never buy no car new, brother. You're losing so much money. 81000 Like I said, you don't want that. What's the best deal I've seen out here? I guess 50000 miles is decent. Like I said, 50000 miles is decent. But these Hellcats, bro, they can mess up easy, brother. Your insurance already going to be high on them. They can mess up easy, so you got to add a warranty. So your warranty probably going to be high. Depending on where you live, it can get stolen if you in Atlanta or something, boy. I'm telling you, bro, you don't even want it. This is a decent deal. Okay, it's 2015, but you're not going to have a lot, a lot of features like the car playing and all that. But that jumped 38,000, man, 49. You feel me? These jumps. I'm guessing, bro, 100,000 miles for 47,000 is crazy. But, yeah, man, like I said, if if it was like Camel Care, I'll go, I'll go for something like this one. I like this one. 2018, it's a decent year. 50,000, 27,000 miles. That's 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 something Camel Cat would jump in right now. If I need, you know what I'm saying? If I was coming up, this is something I'd be looking at like this range. A 50, th a 50 ball, 27,000 miles on it, which is decent. A 2018, you know what I'm saying? So you're going to get a lot more features than you would in the other joints. This is probably the one I'd go with right now. I don't know if the title damaged or what, but if it ain't damaged, if it ain't got no wrecks on it, if the title clean, if, if it's not, out, you know what I'm saying? If it's 100% right, like I think. I would go for something like this, 50,000, 27,000 miles. Now, for y'all want to be content creators, I'm not going to lie. Everybody named mama got hell cats and track house, brother. Everybody named mama, like people who did who did all gaming YouTube coming in this world now. We done, we done built the um, hell cats so hot, brother, that the rappers talking about them. All the rappers want a hell cat or a track house now. You know what I'm saying? So it's just so many people who want them now. So the market is oversaturated. I ain't going to lie. So that means a lot of people is trying to do this car content with these Hellcats and stuff. So you got to stand out. So whatever you don't, don't just get one and think it's sweet. Because that car note going to be scrumptious every month. When you see that 1300 come out, you only made, you know what I'm saying, $100. Your boy Camel Cat was there for two years. I'm not going to lie to you. I've been that guy. My, I had my Hellcat for two years since I was 18. I didn't make, I ain't make $1,000 in two years. I swear to God. My checks were looking like $25 and $40. And I had a whole thirteen. No, I had a seven hundred dollar car note. Yeah, my car note was seven hundred dollars then. But I had a whole seven hundred dollar car note in big boy insurance, thousands of dollars every month, and I wasn't making no money. But I, I had a vision. I I stood strong. I made it to where I'm at right now because of that. But just know you gotta believe in yourself. And hey, it ain't just easy to get a Hellcat and go viral on YouTube now, cause so many people get them. Back in the day, it was easier. You feel me? But right now, everybody and their mama get them. You, can, you got YouTubers who are already rich getting Hellcats and stuff. You got rappers getting Hellcats. You got producers getting Hellcats to come along. Like, everybody doing it. So just know once you get it, I ain't telling you not to, but know what come with it. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Know what come with it. It ain't, it ain't just, I'm going to wake up. and Nah, you're not going to wake up viral, my boy. It's going to be a lot of time, dedication, and car meets, and traveling, and gas, and insurance, and all that type of stuff, hoping you don't get your car took, robbed, stuff, like, all type of stuff come with it, you gotta know that, so I ain't gonna say don't get it, but I ain't gonna say just get it neither, I'm gonna let you sleep on that, you feel me, you wanna make car content, you wanna do Hellcats, hey, just know you in, you in, you in, you in a big world where it's a lot of competition at, you feel me, you in the ocean where the sharks at, Hey, it's a lot of big boy sharks <laughs> that you gotta that you that you gotta keep up with. I ain't gonna cap. You feel me? But if you can do it, if you made for it, go for it. But if you're not, just leave it where it is. Get you a little scat pack or something. You know, be 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 chill. But uh, cause don't scratch yourself out with this stuff. But I guess the market decent. Let me go to another page. Like I said, 2016. This junk got a wide body on it. 
Okay, fifty thousand. Like he put it on there, but I could deal with it. This fifty thousand, fifty three thousand miles. Twenty twenty two. Hell okay, red eye. It gotta have that wide body though, bro. What a wide body boy is it? Fifty fifty one thirty seven thousand. Hey man. This color hard, it's a rap, ain't it? I ain't gonna lie. I ain't gonna lie, bro. The market is crazy for these Hellcats right now. They is crazy on these Hellcats right now. 2015. So yeah, that's the best one I've seen. The year I'd probably get would be a 2018. So let me let me look up 2018. Cause I'll for sure not go below 2018. That's what I would do, but let's see a 2018. Let's see what this one 18 is going for. 71, 69. This a decent deal, but it ain't no wide body. 53, 39. That's a good one. That's a good one. This still the best one I done seen. This black one right here. I guess it got a wreck on it, but if it don't got a wreck on it, that's the best one I done seen. This in the veal. 57, 62. That's a decent deal. Yeah. I would try to go to an 18, get one of these, something like that. And just add the wide body on it for three, four thousand. But. Yeah, but uh, the Hellcat market still holding strong, bro. And it's a lot of people doing it. It's a lot of views. It's a lot of, a lot of, a lot of everything comes to these Hellcats. Views, likes, interactions. Like, people love these Hellcats, bro. I can tell you one thing. Hellcats has the strongest fan base on YouTube. That's facts. But, yeah, man, I, I hope I help y'all out. Uh, like I said, what you want to do is, if you, ain't got, if you ain't got money to put down right now, then just get you, like, a scat pack or a V6. You know what I'm saying? Put you down, like, two, three thousand. Pay your car note for, like, six, seven months. Then try to go up and see what they say. You feel me? But if you ain't got no credit right now, don't you're not gonna be able to get no hell cat unless you put a big bag down. If you don't have that big bag, get you a V six or a scrap pack. And then work your way up. You know what I'm saying? To a scrap pack, then a hell cat. I had to do it, brother. I wanted the red eye. What I do, I went back and got another hell cat, that charger. I, I ain't want that charger, that white charger y'all seen. <laughs> I already had a hell cat for a whole two years. I wanted to go red eye, but I couldn't get it. You feel me? And guess what? You gotta work your way to that. It ain't easy, but just know if you're getting this to do content with it, hey, it's a long road ahead of you, bro. Be, hey, just keep believing and do something different. Because everybody doing the same thing ain't a lot to you, so you got to know that. So have you a plan when you get this junk? Don't just get it and just get it. Just have you a plan and execute your plan for like six months and see and, and calculate yourself. See if you're progressing or not. If you ain't progressing, hey, reevaluate yourself. What ain't working? What is working? Go with it, but. I think I pretty much explained to y'all right now. I would get a 2018 for like 62, 63 or below. Why about it, that junk? If you're going to do YouTube, that's on you. But at the end of the day, but like I said at the beginning of the video, make sure you got it. Like I said, hold up. Like I said at the beginning of the video, make sure y'all see me. You a grown man, boy. You a grown man. Don't let nobody on YouTube tell you whether, whether you should or whether you should not get a Hellcat. Or whether you should or whether you should not start YouTube. You a grown man, boy. And if, if it's a girl, watch you a whole girl. Like, you a whole girl. Like, you ain't my girl. So, why you care with any YouTuber? Say what I say. Go ask your boy. Go ask your boyfriend. You feel me? If you ain't got them, hey. <laughs> hey. Hey, brother. You still shouldn't take my advice. No other YouTube advice. But, yeah, bro. I hope I helped y'all out with that. I had to clickbait y'all a little bit with that title. It really ain't clickbait because it can go either way. Depends on how you take it. But it's your boy Camel Cat. I had to drop a plot. I reaction for y'all today. Let me know what y'all want to see me react to most of. Like, let me know in the comment section. You feel me? We out. Peace.